Fora TV. The world is thinking. Here's an example in the news lately of how people don't think clearly about words. Uh, the F word came up in the, before the Supreme Court recently. I call it the F word because that's what the New York Times calls it. Um, and um, Chief Justice Roberts said, why do you think the F word has shocking value or emphasis or force? Uh, he asked a lawyer for Fox Television. Apparently Fox Television wants to use the F word. I don't know. Uh, and uh, the chief, uh, yeah, right, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> I think they have uh, taken the F word up to something to, lately. But uh, the chief justice answered his own question because it is associated with sexual or excretory activity. That's what gives it its force. Which I mean, there are lots of words connected with sexual or excretory activity that are perfectly. Well, you know, you, you can even say sexual or excretory activity in the New York Times. Uh, but, and Justice Antonin Scalia, the uh, people's, uh, you know, <laughs> stepped in and said, he, uh, Justice Antonin Scalia added that this was the reason people, quote, don't use golly waddles instead of the F word. <laughs> yeah, it's arbitrary. I mean, uh, you know, uh, if golly waddles was associated with uh, sexual or excretory activity, it would be just as good as the F word, which is just ridiculous. I mean, you wouldn't say uh, no golly waddling way or something like that. Just, <laughs> golly waddles would be a silly word for anything connected with the F word because it doesn't sound right. Well, the F word has a great deal of sonic value to it. It's, uh, it t the F word sounds a little bit like putting a foot in the mud and pulling it out, if you think about it. Uh, it's a rude word for a, uh, for a uh, very intimate thing. And therefore, it has a lot of uh, effect, partly because it's connected to uh, intimacy, but also because it has a rude sound to it. it. If it weren't for that sound, even words like screw has a certain force, but I bet you can say that in the New York Times because it's just not as expressive of what, uh, as the S word is, F word is.